Divine Feminine, it does feel like you are having to really dig deep, purge some old stuff that's really triggering a lot of fears. So I get the last quarter moon in Scorpio, reveal what needs to be seen. Then I get first quarter moon in Cancer, push through any insecurities. So there's definitely some third eye chakra activations that's taken place. Then I get full moon in Aquarius, be real. And then what's underneath the deck is let your fears dissolve and detoxify. So there's three full moons showing up. <clears throat> so you're definitely having to let go of something. And it's bringing in a lot of fears, okay? Um, ride the waves. Life lessons, growth, you will get through this, okay? Beneath the surface, what's really driving you? True motives, breaking free. Yeah, you're breaking free. Uh, ancient wisdom, the intelligence is within you. Yes, and follow the stream, dedication, trust, future rivers and oceans. Yes. Okay. So, push through any insecurities. Let those fears go. You know, fear is a liar. Be real. Be honest about where you're at, where you're trying to go. And allow for um, growth to take place. 144. What is the past lesson Divine Feminine's working through at this moment? What is the past lesson Divine Feminine's working through at this moment? Practice self-love. Nurture your inner child. And that might, that, that may be, okay, bring in some insecurities. Mm -hmm. It can do that. Present area focus for Divine Feminine. Healing separation, go within. It's not outside of you. The more you go within and nurture your inner child, this is how you're going to see what needs to be seen. Okay, there's something that needs to be seen that's driving this transformation. Go within. Nothing is separate from you. Future resolution for Divine Feminine, please. Spiritual awakening, shift or be shift. Yes. Yes, and it does feel like it's third eye chakra activations that's awakening. Okay, you could be having visions. What's going to bring balance to inner self for Divine Feminine? Acknowledge, take responsibility. Take responsibility. Of your own healing. Literally, take responsibility of your own healing. Take responsibility for how far you've come, but also acknowledge that too, right? Be real about the shit that you've overcome. Acknowledge that. Support 333. Support that, right? Celebrate that. What's going to help you to move forward faster? Mission accomplished. Welcome home. Go within. Okay. Here. Call on Archangel Metatron too. Possible solutions and outcomes for Divine Feminine, please. Karmic purge, mirror reflection, and sacred sexuality assessing the unified field master alchemist violet flame call in zadokil too okay call in zadokil let's see what is this karmic purge mirror reflections okay that's taking place for divine feminine what is this karmic purge
So this purge is taking place with you, Divine Feminine. Because I get the King of Pentacles, the Page of Pentacles, and the Nine of Pentacles. So Divine Feminine, you are the one that's going through the transformation, okay? And this purge is definitely connected to a masculine. And that's what's being balanced. Um, it does feel like you need to let go of who this King of Pentacles is. Could have been someone that you um, had a fling with because there is sacred sexuality here. Mirror reflections. And uh, could have been some gaslighting, breadcrumbing. Okay, this can be breadcrumbing. So, yeah, Divine Feminine, bring your power back into you. Nothing is separate outside of you. Okay, I love you guys. I hope these messages find you well. And we'll talk very soon.